Tom and I have been talking about shooting in Venice for 14 years now. One of the reasons I'm drawn to it is it hadn't been shot in quite the way I imagined shooting it. It's a very difficult location to shoot. There are no vehicles allowed in this city. Everything has to be brought in by boat, then carried to set by hand. It's my first time in Venice. It's mine too. We wanted Venice to have a completely different feel from the rest of the movie. And then we made that more challenging by deciding to shoot a sequence entirely at night. There was no better place than to shoot a sequence at the Doge's Palace. It's the signature landmark of Venice. We brought in digital projectors that actually made the Doge's Palace something of a character. We wanted the building to feel alive. We staged a party and decided to make it about light and color. It's been a long time, friend. A chase scene is a signature of every Mission Impossible. We wanted to do something different this time. Venice is this eerie and spooky world with its narrow alleys and corridors. If you're a stranger here, it's very easy to get lost. This becomes very much a labyrinth in which the team is lured. There's fights happening simultaneously. Each one of the actors is trained in a different fighting style, designed to express elements of character and personality. We wanted to really make this a love letter to Venice and to do it in a way that it really had never been done before. 